It is the weekend finale of a series between the main Black Bears and the number five Quinnipiac University Bobcats. Now fed ahead, it's Tellier, two on one. Tellier waits, pass across, shot, big save by Osman. In the neutral zone, there's Pennington. He's stripped by Trudeau. Trudeau trying to cut to the net. Now a chance and a penalty coming. And now backhands it in deep to Lyndon Green. Now Josh Trudeau trying to pass that across. Puck is loose in the slot. Shot was blocked. That was Josh Trudeau. Swings it left side. Another block. And that was by Rassinen. Bradley Nino with it. Fires and Duplessis there to gobble it up. And as McGrory, the freshman, out through center to the trailing. Pennington is shot and fought off. Hansen will slide that puck in. Pennington looks over his shoulder. They battle in the corner with 7.20 to go in the first. Now Trudeau. Back along the left side to the point. Brazil scores! A rocket from the blue line just under the crossbar. It's his first of the season and main leads 1-0. I'm going to guess that Duplessis would like to have back. It seemed like he saw it all the way and just kind of missed it with his glove. Um, you know, they, they have to try and fill that void. Off the draw, McGee scores! The Bobcats return fire, and the game is tied at one! The Bobcats got tremendous contributions offensively from their defensemen, and now it's McGee after a face-off win, scoring his first goal of the year and tying this game with 6.03 to go in the first period. And so often for Quinnipiac, it begins with an offensive zone face-off win. And now it is power to Anthony Cipollone, and that one went a little bit wide. The Bobcats have not been good on the power play this season. Just 3 of 24. That's 12.5%. That's about 44th in the nation. Backdoor pass. Tellier, a rocket from the base of the circle, hit the side of the goal. Winnipeg will have some time to begin the power play in the second, unless they can do something here. Philly on with two to Tellier. He shoots, save, made of the horn sounds. Pinching can't keep it in. Here come the Bobcats, two on one if they hurry. Quillen waits. Oh, and a nice oh. defensive play by Friel. Got his stick in the lane on that intended pass for Lipkin. For Maine, and then got the second assist on the game winner. Now coughs it up, off to the races. It's Trelar. Trelar moves in. Trelar to the net. He scores! Trelor on the breakaway and the Cats lead, two to one. Uhl dropping the puck kind of blindly right onto the stick of Trelor. Came in with speed, flipped it forehand over the right shoulder of Osman and the... Now Duplessis, aside from that one goal that he gave up where he looked a little bit awkward with the glove, has been real splendid in this game. Meanwhile, cutting to the net, a chance by... Oh, looking for his second of the weekend, and Duplessis stands his ground and makes the save. Bounces yep. off of the glass now, pinching Tellier across Quillen. Oh, and he broke his stick trying to one-time that. To Moore for an open Jaden Lee in the circle, chipped down low, top of the slot, shot hit off the side of the goal. Tellier to the circle, a chance, and a rocket by Moore is kicked away by Osman. He would have had a break, instead drops it off in Serbone. Can't get to it, is cutting from the right wing was Josh Nadeau. Has it on his string, Nadeau coming around in front, Nadeau to the net, and the shot got blocked. Here's Bradley Nadeau, top line on for Maine, trying to get some momentum after the kill, a chance from the circle, and that one is stopped as Josh Nadeau is robbed by Vinny Duplessis with 8.15 to go. And now here comes Matthew McGrory, who shovels that in from center ice. Osman plays it, pressuring his power, power takes it away, down in front, they jam away. Kicked out high to Sully Scholey. Bradley Nido across ice for Josh Nido. Now back to Lesikowski. Waits it out, moves left to shot. Same made, puck loose. Top of the crease, there's a strum and the whistle stops play. There's a penalty on Trelor. So a holding penalty. Putting Maine on the power play. There's a chance by Brazil. Blocked in front. There's a chance by Josh Nido and Jaden Lee blocked it. Trelor back to Martin to the half boards for Tellier. Creeps in a shot off the stick of Osman. Here come the Cats. Travis Trelor to the point. Legault with a shot blocker save made 
by Osman. Spinning around with Trelor. Drops that back to Marcellus. Out to the point, a chance, that one block. Wraparound try, and they score! Marcellus, an amazing athletic effort, and the Bobcats lead by a pair! You know, the blocker save was made, and the, the puck had hang time, waiting for the puck to come down, but watch Marcellus come here, come around, waste no time, and wow! Oh, now here come the Bobcats, three on three, it's Chernetsky in there, waiting in front, Tupker pushed it wide, Taken away by Quillen, finds Tellier, inching in, stopping short, pass in front for Quillen, and he missed it, it was right there for him. Lesikowski contains, in deep to Friel, banks it to Arnott at the point, and the shot got through into Plessy. A tough save of Marcellus, Serbone, late to the puck, Brazil got it first, now lifted ahead by Friel. Off the skate of Moore, we got a penalty here. Contact to the head. So Maine down two. I mean, this is the opportunity, Rich, they've been looking for all night. Three and a half left in the five-minute major penalty on the Bobcats. And a good play. What a stick in there by Breen to knock that down. Antonacci with the shot, and it got through. Duplessis there with the save. They're looking towards the net. Out of the crease is the goaltender, Osman, but they'll have to come back and... Waited out as the puck was deflected out. And good night in the circle, and they were forced. And now getting back is Osman because <laughs> Tupker's got it on a partial breakaway and a nice defensive effort made by Brazil. Now Osman to the bench, and this time he's able to make it all the way there. 24 seconds left in the power play for Maine. It's a six on four with an empty net. In front of chance, and Scott shanked it. Back over to Bradley Nadeau, snaps it down, Lewis in front, diving is Duplessis, puck still loose, there's a penalty coming, and the puck is cleared all the way down, you won't get an icing here, it is back to five on five. The penalty is on the Bobcats though, around the net, empty net here for Maine, Bobcats up by a pair, looking to seal it, and that one sent to the open net, it goes in, Sam Lipkin, an amazing empty net goal! From about 100 and, well, let's see, where'd he shoot it from? About 160 feet or so? He'll take it. So Quinnipiac will avoid a third straight loss. They'll go back to four and three and split this weekend series with the Maine Black Bears who suffer their first loss of the season.